Welcome back, Courage Pack. Gearzu here. Today we are going to dig up some lore in For Honor. The story of For Honor is set in an alternate reality, where the way of the sword is still the way of life. The game's intro movie begins with a great cataclysm, a terrifying event where we see the ground tear itself asunder, and people scream in horror, running for their lives, as their wells become geysers of mud and filth. The battlements of a castle soon collapse. This leaves the world scarred and short of resources. Those who survived wandered through a hapless wasteland. Conflict was inevitable. The Vikings suffered bitter cold and precious few stocks. The samurai had lost their home and could take only what they found. The knights defended what little was left to them against intruders. Thus, as Apollyon remarks, this hardship sparked a thousand-year war. Wait. Wait, what? Shouldn't we see remarkable technological advancements coming from this millennia-long conflict? We eventually learned that new advances in war tech were largely suppressed over time. If necessity is the mother of invention, then Apollyon must be her twisted half-sister. With that in mind, no. Technology can't flourish if it isn't given a chance in the first place. If you find the observables in the third mission, Apollyon tells you of the eight leaders of the Blackstone Legion, and how the others now rest, leaving her in charge. What if the others were a long line of leaders, and Apollyon is just the latest link in the chain? So, how did the Blackstone Legion maintain this control for a thousand years? By keeping technological development to a minimum, and gleefully slaughtering anyone who isn't a wolf, as Apollyon puts it, I feel that scientists and academics sadly aren't included in this select group, and are thus culled from the population. Gunpowder never got used to its full potential. We do see some evidence of gunpowder in the way of Pugnus Mortis, or the Flash Bomb. However, if technology was stifled beyond that, how could the factions evolve? Ultimately, the Blackstone Legion seeks control. And what's the easiest way to do that? Through chaos. The chaos that lets them slip in wherever they need to be and take whatever they want. That sounds pretty good for me. At any rate, guys, this is my thoughts on the matter. Please, let me know what you think in, your co in the comments below. Remember to subscribe so you can keep getting content from us. And remember, live courageously!